And we're going to show Grace how to do a couple of easy holiday updos that she can do herself or with the help of a friend. So the first thing that we're going to do with Grace's hair, all we've done is we've just brushed it up to make sure that there are no tangles in her hair. Uh, so we're just going to go through and lightly mist it with some hairspray. I'm using Sebastian Reshaper. A lot of people try to set their hair and they don't uh, put any product in beforehand. Uh, and so what happens is after they set the curl, the curl falls out right away. Searching for words when your voice stopped me from talking first. You knocked me off of my feet, and it never felt so good to leave. Now I can finally say, So now the curls have some time to set. Take these pins on it and just let the curl fall out naturally for now. So the less we disturb it, the better. Another little tip you can do for the um, crown here, if mm -hmm. you find that you have a lot of challenges obtaining height mm -hmm. uh, and volume, is a lot of the time you can back comb just the base before you put the roller, the hot roller in. And that will give you a nice little cushioning base to work off of so that when you pull the roller out, you don't then have to disturb the curl. So all I'm going to do is with a paddle brush, because the first look we're doing is just really soft, it's half up, half down, I'm just going to loosely brush this out with a paddle brush. And so one little tip for that comb and teasing mm -hmm. is to not go up and down. Just down. If you go up and down, no, actually if you do like in a circular motion, if you do it in a circular oh, motion, okay. what's going to happen is it's going to be a lot easier for you to brush it out. Oh, okay. Oh. 